Hey everyone, Alex here, and today's video is about a guy named Hamza. You might know him, you might not. He's really big, actually I think he is the biggest self-improvement channel, self-improvement dedicated channel. Uh, my computer is having a frenzy, hang on, he doesn't like to mention Hamza. But this video is why I stopped watching him regularly, and I'm going to go into the one big reason why, and let's get into it. The one big reason I stopped watching Hamza is contradiction. This dude constantly contradicts himself, and he used to not do that very often, but ever since about, I would say, like, six to nine months ago, his content just started contradicting everything he had said before. One minute bodybuilding is the best, then it's strength training, then those are dumb, just do the Adonis workout and functional movements, and then it's back to bodybuilding. First, the tight shirt wearing, gold watch wearing, red pill kind of guys, sleeping around, are part of the problem, and now he's a tight shirt, gold watch wearing guy sleeping around. <laughs> I, I don't get it. He, his advice changes every month, and it's just not that good anymore. First he says, be authentic, then he releases a full guide onto a first date, telling you exactly what to do and exactly how to act, instead of being authentic. And if you want an unbiased viewpoint on his paid community Adonis school, go watch Greg DeGuru's video about it. As for my opinion on his unpaid free community, um, unpaid and free mean the same thing, I don't know why I felt the need to put that in the script. As for his unpaid private community Adonis gang, it has some value in it, there's some decent guides in there, decent posts, but for the most part, it's just become mental masturbation and a copycat of Reddit, so that's fantastic. Hamza has helped me and a lot of other people in their self-improvement journey. He introduced me to meditation, gratitude, journaling, and no fap. But as for right now, I've stopped watching him regularly for that main reason, and I don't plan to continue watching him very regularly, maybe like once a month. I know I just said if you want an unbiased view, but if you want my view on his Adonis school, I have heard, I've never been in it, I've heard from people that they've had to pay twice to get in, and the entry fee is $500, yes, $500 for a community, and I've been told that if you say something that goes against Hamza's beliefs, then you get kicked out without any sort of uh, warning or whatever. I'm not sure how true that is, that's just what I've heard, that's something to keep in mind. But that's gonna do it for this video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this next video. Bye. <laughs> also, my teeth are not yellow. That's just the lighting here. That's the lighting. It's because the, the the light is yellowish because of the because of the lamp cover is yellowish. That means my teeth are gonna look a little bit yellow. I just brushed them. They're not yellow.